Title tags or meta titles are really important for local SEO, but many businesses leave these undone. But here's the thing, they're really good for SEO and brand recognition. And that's what we're gonna be talking about today, title tags. Hi, I'm Craig McBreen, and I like to demystify marketing to help small business owners or those tasked with marketing move through the marketing maze one small step at a time. So what the heck is a title tag? Well, it's the clickable link you see in a search results page. It's that little title you see in the tab at the top of a browser, and they even appear in social media networks. So now you might be asking, why is a little old title tag so important? Well, they don't carry the SEO weight they used to, but they're still important for a variety of reasons. Number one, it's often the first glance, the first exposure somebody's gonna to have to your business because they're searching for your business. Two, it helps Google understand the context of your pages. And three, it's really important for click-throughs. That is, you want somebody to click through on that sweet link to your page. So how do you write title tags, good title tags for local business? Well, consider a few things. Number one is character count is really important. That is, Google measures title tags by pixel width, which is like 600 pixels, which translates to about 70 characters long. So if you've ever done a search and you've seen that little dot, 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 that's because somebody wrote one that was too long or they didn't write one at all and Google pulled it from the page. But here's the thing, web platforms make this super easy. If you're using WordPress, there's a plugin called Yoast that'll tell you if your title tags are too long. If you're using Wix, Weebly, Squarespace, most other platforms, again, they'll have an SEO section that makes this super easy to do. Next, you need to use keywords first. That is primary keywords. So say for example, you are a mobile pet groomer in Fort Collins, Colorado. That's what you would write in your title tag, mobile pet grooming service, Fort Collins, Colorado. But you also want to include a unique meta title for each page. So some of the page samples might read something like mobile dog grooming service, Fort Collins, Colorado, Mobile Cat Groomers, Fort Collins, Colorado. You get the picture, just each title tag needs to be unique. A good rule to follow is this, primary keyword, product service kind of goes together. Then the name of your business, then the city and state. Also, you want to avoid using too many keywords. You don't want to get spammy. So an overly ambitious pet groomer might write something like this. You do not wanna do that because, well, it's not a good user experience and it doesn't make Google happy. And you do wanna make Google happy. So what about local? Well, just like the examples I've shown, include your city, state at the end of each title. Now, as long as your titles are unique to each page, you can put your city and state at the end of each. This is incredibly important. But this isn't an exact science. So you could write the primary keyword first or you could write the city name first. As long as you stick with a general formula, you'll be okay. Just make sure they're unique to each page. And finally, write for customers first, because again, this is often the first time somebody's gonna see your business, and click-throughs are golden. Again, if you write a really good meta title, you'll get that click-through. So, meta titles, great for SEO, really good for click-throughs, and as a result, you will see results. See you in the next video.